I thought it would be fun to give that viral latte look a try. So let's see how it goes. I'm gonna start with, um, I like to use Elf's Halo Glow Liquid Filter. And I'm just gonna put this in a few spots and blend it. It gives a really good, uh, just a really nice base. A little bit of shimmer without sparkling. <laughs> Um, and so this latte look is all about bronze, being bronze, right? This is probably not going to be my everyday go-to look, but it did look fun. So here we are. Okay, so have that move blended in. It just creates a beautiful little sheen. Um, so next, I'm going to do something very different. And once I can find my right brush, here we go. Uh, I'm going to use bronzer to contour. Normally, I do not use bronzer to contour. Normally, I use my contour to contour. <laughs> but we're going for that bronzed look. So let's go. And you're gonna see, I'm gonna bring it down on my neck. Mm-hmm. Now, I've never done this, so I might go a little light and then come back and darken it. All right, so I did that. Now I'm gonna take my um, accent highlight and I'm going to brighten the center of my face. You have to forgive me, I have to turn the fan on. <laughs> Anyone else know that struggle? Please say it's not just me. Okay, now with this look, so I just took my accent highlight and I put it in the center of my face. Boop. Here, here, and the inner and outer corners of my eyes and then on top of my eyelids, yes, okay? Now, um, the traditional latte look that they're talking about doesn't have um, a main highlight shade, but I'm gonna go ahead and put mine on anyway because this is my video and I'll do it how I want to. <laughs> so, okay, so I am putting my main shade pretty much everywhere else, right? All right, oh, you know what I forgot to do? I was actually looking forward to doing this. Uh, I lost my brush again, here it is. This is my detail brush. I use this brush to do my uh, contour. Uh, yep, I use it to do my contour. I use this end to actually do my color correcting fed really lately under my eyes. So, here we go, a little contour on my nose. Okay, and then I'm gonna go back in just a smidge and brighten that right there. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead at this point and I'm gonna spray my brush. This is my 3D brush with my setting spray. And let's just tap that in. Let's start to blend this out. Now remember, we're looking for a bronzed look. Now, we're not done yet. This is basically my normal application, just using bronzer instead of contour to achieve that dimensional look. That's why it's called 3D makeup. Okay, so I have that blended in. Now, we're gonna start playing and making the con the bronzy look. Okay, ready? I'm going to add Tropicana. This is really pretty. Okay. I'm gonna take my blush brush and just kind of tap that in. All right. Here we go. 
Now we're gonna do the bronze. <laughs> I'm gonna take confetti, which is one of our cream illuminators. And I'm gonna just put it in a few places. And this little guy, his place, his job is to reflect light. And it's really hard to see in this lighting, but pro I promise you, this is, I love illuminator. Okay, now I'm gonna do something I don't normally do. And I'm going to double up. I'm gonna double up my illuminator. This is Georgia, which is my absolute favorite powder illuminator we have. And I am adding that on top of my cream illuminator. Okay, so I am actually gonna go back in and add a little bit more bronze um, as contour. Unfortunately, my head was sweaty and it just doesn't, but there we go. Let me make a little bit more, a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Wait till you see this lip. I mean, I'm doing everything. I'm gonna do the lip. I'm gonna do eyeshadow. Okay, now I'm gonna take, oh, let's take, oh dear, I don't even know. I'm gonna take Bubba, and I am going to tap and do the whole lid, right? Tap and do the whole lid in the crease, above the crease. Okay, just smooth that out. We're going all browns and shimmers and golds and I love it. Okay, uh, now I'm going to take, I have Sedona and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna add this in the crease on top of Bubba. And again, I'm coming up above the crease because look, I open my eyes and my crease goes away. <laughs> so, okay, so I got that done. Now I'm gonna tap into, I have cocoa here and I'm just gonna tap on the end. Oh yeah. I just wanna create some drama, right? normally do this where I put it underneath but I decided since I'm doing a pretty dramatic look why not right Ooh. okay last shade I'm gonna do is angels landing and I'm gonna tap with my finger and I am just going to tap this baby on the lid from the inner corner and meet that cocoa. Mm -hmm. Just about done with my version of that latte look. Ooh, fancy. All right, now I am going to take, we're gonna do my lips. Uh, actually, I'm gonna make, I, I grabbed that contour, no, nope, the bronzer. I'm gonna make, do a little bit of bronzer under my lip and above my lip, right? Make my lips look a little pouty. Okay, I am now gonna take uh, one of our, this is our lip liner. It's called Suede. I'm just gonna tap that on my lips, just like this. Yeah, and you wanna blend it. Mm-hmm. Okay, just like that. Now I'm gonna take 
Homecoming, which is like a peachy nude. And it is one of our shades of the season. It's very pretty. Very pretty. Oh. Mm. Oh, I wish I had better lighting so you could see how cool this looks. I was worried it was going to be a little bit too much, but I don't actually think it is. <laughs> so, last, this is going to seem silly. Check this out. I'm going to go back to Georgia. And I'm just going to tap it in the center. And there you have it. So this, ladies, I'm going to just throw on some mascara and be done. This is my take on the latte look that is all over TikTok and wherever else it's being shared. It's kind of fun doing something totally different. And since I'm doing it here with you for the first time, I had no idea how it was going to turn out and if I was going to like it. And I'm thrilled to say I, I do. It's great for the summer. A little bit glam for the summer. What do you think? Let me know if you have heard of this latte trend. And if you have tried it, which steps did you try? Thank you.